Hello there, citizens of Prime Might Nation and their countries that has had a welcome to different news today. You're playing the Modern Corporation. Finally. We're going to go into core suppression of day 48. <clears throat> um, this is most likely going to be the last core suppression available for me. Uh, and uh, as such, we're going to maybe a be a little bit more lenient with the fact that um, we've lost three employees, actually, not two, yesterday. Uh, we also lost Kalendon, and I have only noticed this after I was already done uh, with... Well, the day and the suppression itself. Uh, it happened partially because of the fact... Uh, well, not partially. It happened partially. It happened entirely because of Yassad. Um, because of Yassad. I didn't see that we actually have lost Kalendon. Which is unfortunate. Is an unfortunate demise for him, but... Um, we move on without him. I also have tried to using this item, and uh, let's just say never again. This one does not seem that bad. Uh, I think I also tried working him. Yesterday I tried to record a video, but uh, I felt just too bad to do anything. And I, I just think that in a state where I can barely even think, let alone talk and comment over things and pay attention at the same time to all the things that are happening in the facility. I think it's just impossible for me to uh, make a fun video, and I doubt I would have made any progress anyway, so... Uh, so yeah, instead what we're going to do is record now, and hopefully we will manage to be successful. So, the thing with this person, uh, T-1-68, is that he um, will escape no matter what we do, really. Um, if, if, any, if any of our employees work this guy, works this guy, we are going to have a bad time. I mean, not, not really have a bad time, but he's going to escape. Luckily, uh, nobody in this department actually has, like, there's no one in this department. Uh, so we can just do everything safely. Uh, just going to also make sure that we've got all the equipment that we can. Which is not the case, which means I'm going to send uh, Yumiko to do Snow White Apple. <clears throat> we need to make use of the fact, it seems like Yasod, uh, not Yasod, sorry, Hezed, is using, p picking two web types of damage from the get-go. Oh, there we go. I also gave Infinity Gauntlet to Jesse. Uh, the Infinity Gauntlet seems alright. It does attack very, very, very quickly, which means that we can actually make a really, really good use out of, uh, like, it, its ability procs very often. And it also has this charged attack, where you do a lot of damage. Let's not forget about the train ticket. Uh, with, as, as far as, like, Yin goes, I think we're gonna work Yin also. It deals black damage, so it would be a shame for us to not work it. This Sabramati deals white damage. Um, I think we also need to make use of the fact that Telemachus does not take any... Um, he doesn't take any uh, white damage. So we should be uh, make, taking, taking use of that when we should be taking white damage. Remember, the Telemachus takes no white damage. <clears throat> Just because of Da Capo, really. Uh, another thing is, since we lost Canadan, unfortunately we, lost, we also lost the Scythe from Da Capo. So I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to send... Um, when, we, when we get other types of damage picked, or we can also send Canadan to do that. That is also viable. Kalan takes no white damage, so it's probably a good idea for him to go in there and uh, try to get a common result on um, the silent orchestra. All right, we got a good got good things going here. We've got another one of these suits. It's probably good for us to make use of the extraction team for as long as possible, so I'm not going to actually execute it immediately. not going to execute it immediately. Instead, I'm going to try to milk um, our abnormalities. I I'll try to milk their bonus for as much as I can. 
Calm down as we always do. Yes, please. Please do. Um, I'm going to send Petri over here. I'm going to send... Uh, I'm going to work Yin probably one more time. Uh, there's no risk in working Yin. When the work result is bad is the only time... Uh, if, if we don't use the item, that is. If we don't use the item, then the only risk is that uh, we get a bad result. And that's quite unlikely to happen. We can all, we should also work Snow White's Apple. We got a common result in the Sinet Orchestra, that's excellent. I'm going to keep trying to get as many boxes out of Sinet Orchestra as possible. So we're about we also, we also need to keep in mind that we're about to go to the next level here. Alan, my boy, you gotta go work this thing again. Um 47.6% is still enough, I think, is pretty good. So I'm going to send Telemachus in there. Uh, okay. And then we don't work anything until everyone is done with their work. Are you done with Yin too? Yes, you are. 47 only? Huh, okay. Ah, we're one box short of being done with um, Snow White. Oh, train? What? Did I, didn't I pick up the train ticket? What? Okay, um... Apple, my big boy, you gotta get out of here as fast as you can. And I guess I'll give him a black shield also, but I don't know. Like if he gets if he gets hit by the train, there's not much that I can do really. Right, he is fine. We only lost like a few pawns, I think, which is not a big deal. But I should be more careful about the train. I understand. Right, that was another common result in the silent orchestra. Lovely, 105 boxes. A hundred and five boxes is quite all right in my book. Um, so since all the work here is done, I think a good idea is to go work the newer abnormality. Uh, I think repression is the best one for it. Maybe it's insight. I think repression is the best one. Let's go work repression. We'll work repression to go to the next level. I think the next department to go is going to be disciplinary team. It gives us 5 attack speed of the employees, it's not particularly very good. So now we take increased black damage, uh, which means that we should probably make use of uh, Nicole to work on Yin. And Frost, where is Frost? Frost, you also gonna work on Yin. Uh, as far as white damage goes, now Petri can work the Silent Orchestra. With his 55.4% chance, I think this is going to be good. Focus on working the white damage abnormalities. Oh yeah, also I did some rearrangement. Oh yeah, we also got uh, abnormality meltdowns. I almost forgot about that. Uh, Sentel Mach is in here, and I guess we can ignore Beauty and the Beast, but actually, since we need to collect as much energy as possible, I'm not going to do that. I gave I, I did some edit I did some weapon rearrangements and now uh, Lama is using the black bullet. Light of Seven has got the sword. Apple is using uh, Sound of a Star. Cheese is also using the katana and uh, Stimel Sal is also using Sound of a Star. I thought that it's better to give those people ranged weapons. In my opinion, at least it it is better to give those people ranged weapons. I'm going to still send uh, Jesse to do uh, work on Snow White's Apple one more time, just so that we can get it out of the way. Alright, Funeral of Dead Butterflies. Yeah, it's the best thing is repression for it. Okay. I didn't read the abnormality story, by the way, for uh, Yin. The black pendant is darkest color of all, blackest of all the darkness in the world. Employees should not touch or possess the pendant. Merely looking at it makes one's heart dark. It seems that it was originally a circle, however, it is separated from the other half. Many employees called it the pendant of devil. They said just looking at it makes you endlessly depressed. Employees didn't like being in the same place as it. It was the polar opposite of its other half. <clears throat> they complained, I wish there was just the white pendant. Its surroundings erode. Those who come near it suffer. It wasn't what he wanted to do. It was happening merely because of the energy it exudes. It wondered, why do I exist? 
If my very existence itself makes people suffer and depressed, maybe I should not have been born at all, like they say. Maybe my creator only intended to make the white pendant, and I am nothing but an unintentional result. Then how can the being that is denied be erased from this world? One day, I heard someone calling me. It is time. It's time for us to reunite. I was leaving the place that I once thought I will never leave. I found myself swimming away from it. Everything that I pass becomes ruins. Destruction was nothing but an instinct. I could not stop it, nor hide it. I could see a white pendant. No, the part of myself that I haven't seen for a long time swimming towards me. For the first time ever, I felt meaning in my existence. We used to be one. I am, so you are. You are, so I am. We were originally together. It was a fruitless thing to divide us. Now you become the sky, and I become the land. The face of an employee who had the cheerful eyes, distorted with sadness. The employee who just cried all along, finally stopped. The employee who broke his leg, stood on his own legs. The employee who was heading to the lounge, bled to death. As the end circles back to the beginning, those who had hope are met with despair, and those who had despair are met with hope. At the end of the beginning, the dragon that has become a great avatar flew through the sky. So yeah, I, I saw what happens when these things reunite, uh, the white one and the black one. Um, never again. <laughs> and I'm going to read the story for uh, Funeral of the, of the Dead Butterflies after we actually unlock its complete story. Uh, this is going to be a good result. That's not great. Yeah, it was a good result. That's a bit unfortunate. We need a little bit more boxes. Just a few more boxes, really. So perhaps it is a good idea for me to go and uh, destroy the silent orchestra. The bad thing is, though, it's going to kill a bunch of people in the extraction team. So let's maybe wait until... Uh, maybe wait on that. And not do it just yet. I could also risk a roughly 20% chance of success and... Uh, Hope for a hope to not get a bad result, but that is kind of futile in my opinion. Okay, um, let's let's work the funeral of the dead butterflies. It is going to escape now, but that's fine. Cat is here. He's a bit angry. So, we're going to encounter a Dawn, and that's not particularly a very good thing. Uh, depending on what kind of Dawn we get, really. Yeah, so the Infinity Gauntlet is pretty great. Um, actually, in my opinion, at least it is. It's just that now we have to wait until uh, his modifier expires. Jesse's modifier, that is. Before we can really work anything with him. We might as well wait until the next level to work um, in. Let's unlock the rest of the story. I am interested in unlocking the weapons, not as much the ego suit. What happens when people die? What happened to those who work here? They must return to their home, where their family and warmness await. But everyone knows that the employees can't leave the company unless they retire. Then they must have retired and returned to their homes, having earned what they wanted and full of hope. We are feathers of the wing, but retiring isn't as easy as it sounds, just like how feathers do not fall out on their own free will. Then where did the retired employees go? They are bound to the company the moment they enter. They cannot leave even if they retire. Long ago, in some world, people believed that they become beautiful beings with small wings when they die. What nonsense. If we have wings, can we leave this place? Do we get wings after we retire? The mourner with the colossal baggage on his back is said to have come here to be the savior of all, but now he is trapped like everyone else, roaming the company with only the memory of empty faith. The baggage he carries is a coffin. A large coffin to pay tribute to the employees who have nowhere else to go but it is too small to comfort those innocent sacrifices. Inside it, the butterflies are waiting for the time to sleep. Until then, they flutter their wings carefully, uselessly. Butterflies are supposed to pollinate flowers, but not a single flower blooms in this place. They have no choice but to wait. After all, there must be an end to the world. Very, um... What's it called? 
Poetic. Yeah, I think that's the word that fits here the most. We can send Yumiko to work this one. We can send uh, P3. I'm thinking, like, maybe we should uh, still go for the silent orchestra suppression. Um, now, instead of later, but no, 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 no. We'll, we'll do it after we unlock uh, most of the equipment, because I reckon the extraction team is going to die. So let's try to milk uh, the extraction team suppression for as long as we can. 70%, I'll take it. Uh, you two... No, P3 should go in. Well, it doesn't really matter who goes. They both have high resistance to black damage. Yeah, Thing deals the Thing deals a lot of damage. That is for sure. That's a lot of damage. Okay, we got a common result there. Well deserved punishment for us. Oh my god, oh come on, really? One? Alright, come on, give me, give me, give me something good here. Lovely. Alright, so we are done with Yin, now we can ignore it. We are done with Snow White's apple, we can now ignore it. We're done with the King of Greed as well. Uh, so the only abnormality remains is Funeral of Dead, ba dead Butterflies, and so we need 80... Uh, 172 boxes for that. That's a lot of work, but uh, I think this can be done. I think this definitely can be done. Did I execute a department on this level? No, I have not. Let's execute the disciplinary team as I planned. I'm sorry, disciplinary team. You did good. You were doing a pretty good job until you all died. <laughs> uh, how terrible. All right, we're going we're gonna to have to fight the funeral again, but that's probably fine. Do 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 what? No no no, stay here. Do 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 It's most vulnerable to pale damage, but pale damage sources are a bit far away. And they're not that resistant they're not that resistant to white damage as Jesse is. Yeah, pummel it, pummel it good. Good job. Oh. Crap. Ah, uh, crap. Forgot about this whole nonsense. Um, right, so... Little Red, of course, escapes. Um, she's gonna do a ton of damage. As soon as Dark gets here, we'll get, yeah, there we go, leave. Okay, there we go. Now they just fight, that's fine. <coughs> Gotta be careful about that, uh, I understand. The music is really, really sad. I don't really like the music on this um, on this boss fight. I should position Darkling in such a way that he can uh, react to Little Red escaping. Uh, because I think I, I think we can pretty much guarantee that she's going to escape at some point in the future. <coughs> Good stuff. Let's unlock one of the pistols. I, I, I'm i more interested in the pistols than in the sh suits, because we got... we got better suits than this. And I'm quite interested in these weapons. They seem to be... they're very fast, long-range pistols. We are... I, I would be quite interested in that. <clears throat> Maybe I'd even give it to some employees. Granted, we do have much better weaponry by this point, but... Still, I'd rather unlock it, you know? Unlock the full potential. The power of the fully armed and operational battle station. 
<clears throat> Alright, again, it all depends on what kind of um, dawn we get. I hope we don't get a... Uh, I hope we get Pale and White chosen by Hazet again. But uh, he may choose anything he wants, really. Alright, so we're gonna do one more on the pistols. And we're gonna, we're gonna do one more work on the funeral. Well, no, no, actually, we're gonna continue doing the work on the funeral. Uh, yeah, we're just gonna keep doing work on the funeral. It's just whenever it escapes, we'll have to punch it. That's fine by me. Distortion. Alright. It's a good thing that this um, department doesn't have any uh, employees. I would assume that this wave of butterflies deals a lot of damage to them. Oh, request. Alright, so. We've got a Dawn of White, and we don't have White chosen, so yeah. We're actually fairly safe. We can send Dark Buddhist here. Um, and by fairly safe, I mean we should still kill a bunch of these dudes. Send Apple to do ticket duty. <coughs> Oh no, it's a red fixer, what? Oh, no, no, yeah, it's a red fixer, okay, uh, never mind, so... How do we go about the red fixer then? Well, we don't send, we don't send Dark Buddhist to handle him, that's for sure. Uh, we send, um, Frost and, um, Nicole first and foremost. We send all of our employees that are resistant. We probably send Telemachus here as well. He takes a little too much red damage for my liking, but hey, it's not that big of a deal. So the red damage is not chosen, which is lovely. Let's leave and go over to the security team. Also, uh, I have checked. Yes, you you do these things with uh, uh, on the uh, on on character selection screen. So I've locked Da Capo for Telemachus, for example. I've locked something else. I think I've locked uh, the Cheek one for Dark Buddhist. For Dark... for Dark Dabist. Let's give Telemachus a, a red shield. When more people arrive, I'm... or, or as the Red Fixer gets closer to death, I'm going to move and turn him around. Because I sincerely believe that he should be uh, turned around the other direction. Let's give Telemachus a red shield. Alright, uh, now we can turn them around. Shoot a laser out. Okay, that's fine. Alright, so the main reason why I did that is because he's going to shoot a laser, it's going to sweep around. We already killed a bunch. We already killed off the training team. All right, good. Safe and sound. Uh, let's return everyone to their posts. Uh, Jesse can go do funeral of the dead butterflies. I think I've sent home everyone. Alright, so we've executed the, the training team on this level. And we're going to get a noon soon. Alright, so we're getting a noon. Well, that's going to be black and white damage, which is probably pretty good. All things considered, I don't mind that. I'm not exactly sure when is Gibura supposed to spawn though like that's the only thing that I'm a little bit concerned about is like when is Gibura going to appear because one of the mission one of the missions conditions says uh, suppress or suppress the red mist and I don't know like is she going to just show up some some time in the future like what's going to happen do we have to be prepared for it somehow like I, I don't really understand
Oh yeah, Little Red escaped. I was like, where is the noise coming from? No, it's just Little Red escaping, don't worry about it. Um, so the Mountain of Smiting Bodies is agitated. Which is unfortunate, very. I think it's because, uh, Welfare Team, yeah, Little Red has killed the Welfare Team. That is a little bit upsetting. But I think we can make sure that the mountain is not going to re not going to escape, or at least that we can suppress it really relatively easily. I think at least we can suppress it relatively easily. I'm going to work the mountain, oh not the mountain, the funeral of dead butterflies, and uh, as soon as we finish extracting ego from it, I'm going to execute the extraction team, and then we're we're gonna work the silent orchestra more. Alright, so probably one more time for the funeral release. One more time, one more work, I'm sorry, uh, I mean, for the funeral, and then we'll, we're probably gonna be done with it. <clears throat> and after that point, uh, we're going to. I'm going to make sure that all of my employees are in proper positions for the suppression of Sinet Orchestra. Punch it some! Yeah! Oh, look at that! Jesse's got the special item from him. What does it do? It gives plus one of every stat. Alright, that's that's pretty good. Alright, lovely. Good job. Okay, so, now, um, S4 placements. So, P3... Yumika should be in the room. Maomiji should also be in the room. Dobi should be in the black uh, team. He's in the black ops. Jesse is part of the red team. Uh, Frost is part of the black team. I feel I reckon the black team is going to be doing a lot of damage this time around. Nicole also part of the black crew. Uh, Apple is in the white team. Cheesecake and Light are going to be in the room. Llama is going to be a part of the black team. Okay, so this should be sufficient. And we're just going to use the... Um, what's it called? Alright, so uh, we need to execute the extraction team. I'm... I apologize. Not really. But it was necessary. They were. They are going to die anyway. If we if we are going to release the Sinet Orchestra, the chances of them not dying are like so slim. Super duper slim. Mega slim, I would say. I'm gonna wait until everyone's in position. We don't actually have very much in terms of the red team, though, I realized. Alright, well that's fine. Uh, where is my boy, uh... Tel Telemachos? There he is. 52.8% chance of succeeding. Succeeding? I think this is uh, relatively fine. Remembering that we're going to encounter a noon. The more that we go, the the more we go without Sinet Orchestra escaping, the better. But I would appreciate if we could actually suppress it now, so that I don't have to worry about it later as much. It's going to be a normal result now. But remember, Kalendon, uh, not Kalendon, Telemachus literally can't take white damage, so it doesn't matter how hard it's hit, the, this thing is hitting him. We can always suppress it. We can always suppress it, even if it goes into, uh, even if it goes into Kulfoth Meltdown and white damage type is selected. We can still just send uh, Telemachus in there. You'll be fine. best ensemble in the company. I, I do believe that, yeah. I believe that. Deals with the task without any trouble. Well, he's getting a common result on this thing, which is lovely. Alright, um, perhaps in that case, let's do insight work. For 50% chance. 
Seems like Telemachus is doing pretty good on Silent Orchestra in terms of, like, not fucking it up. Immune. Yeah, he's immune to white damage. Doesn't matter. Doesn't matter how hard it's hitting him. Lovely. I, I love this combination. This is so good. Oh. Oh, he got, he got like, the max possible out of it. Without going into, um... Without going into good result territory. Alright, so we need more boxes, obviously. We need 222 boxes to get uh, these scythes back. So I'm going to keep working this thing while we can. Uh, with Telemachus, we can work, virtually work this all the time. The thing is, the, the only thing is, uh, the success rate is going to go down still. So eventually, we're going to just get no boxes out of it. But as long as we can get boxes out of it, I'm quite quite content working it. Alright, looks like this time we're going to go over. No, we're not. Okay. Telemachus is beast moding it, apparently. He really is dealing with this, no problem. Much 38.8 success chance. Like, surely this is going to be the last work that we do on it. I would like to trigger it still, so perhaps I should just let him do a bad work on Silent Orchestra? We'll see. Yeah, so far this looks like another common result. Yep, another common result. Okay then, um, well we've, we've unlocked the scythe. Should we just keep going? I could also just just force a bad result out of this thing. I think I think I'm going to do that. I want to suppress this thing before the noon. I understand that this is not it is not the most efficient way of dealing with this. I can completely understand that. This is like, oh wow, <laughs> we're going to get a perfectly terrible result on this thing. Alright, that's good. That's good. That's good. Okay, so. I think it's actually a good idea for us to move in here. Okay, so. You move in here. This is your this is your call. We'll give these people white shields. It seems like they do take a lot of damage. On this during this movement. We still need to keep an eye out on the Oh yeah, that's that's good timing. Almost caught the train. We did a lot of damage on movement one. That is pretty good. All right, movement two. Uh, you guys can leave. The the black damage team moves in. They might actually finish it off on the black damage. Although this movement is pretty short, if I remember correctly. We deal so much black damage, though. Yeah. Okay, they finished it off. All right, lovely. Uh, so we, we're going to—I'm going to call everyone home then. In that case, um, I was wondering where did where did the punishing bird go? Okay. Uh, central command can return. You guys can all return. And let's prepare for the noon. Light of seven is the one to move over here. So now we're pretty much ready. We don't need to work uh, the Silent Orchestra anymore. We already, we already got the, the scythe back, uh, thanks to Telemachus' just insane efforts. Um, what do we do? Probably get more boxes. We need to get as many boxes as we can. So let's send someone like... Stimulus Al over here to work. Uh, there. We need to also work... Something that doesn't... Something that deals not black damage. Nothing there deals red damage. We can get some boxes out of nothing there. Some good boxes too. We need we will need boxes. The EE box objective is 
1880. That's a lot of boxes. Okay? That's a lot of boxes. That's a lot of damage! Can you, like, go back home already? That'd be great. Alright, depending on where the noon is going to appear, I'm going to probably execute a lot of employees. Alright, so here's the deal. Information team is not doing anything by now. Plus one success rate is nothing. So you can go away. Movement speed of employees. I think I'll keep if 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 the noon will be near nearby there, I'm going to consider removing it. The uh, central command team is way too central for everything, so I think we're going to get rid of them. As much as we can, at least. We don't have any more bullets. Okay, so. Worked nothing there for 31 box. That's pretty great. 31 box. We've got Blue Star on 27 boxes. That's also great. Alright, let's, um... Alright, what else can we work? We can work... Well, I mean... Hmm. Someone with really, really good black damage resistance can still go work the mountain. Like, it's good boxes, so... And if he gets a lot of successes, then he should be okay. Hey, dude, can you just go back? Thank you, Punishing Bird. Just leave. Nobody likes you. Okay, we got 21 box now and 22 boxes here, so we we should really only work it once. All right, I get it. Even with the black damage resistance, he takes six. That's a lot. He would take 30 damage per hit with with like no resistances. That would be intense. All right. So far, so good boxes though. 25 boxes. Um, all right, so, uh, I think we're ready to trigger the noon. Who is going to do it? I think it should be... I think it should be cheese. Drink a can of soda. What could possibly go wrong? Oh, yeah, well, cheese also got the can of soda thing. <laughs> Ego gift. All right, weapon. So we got a black one. And a white one. The white one is over here. If it goes up anywhere near the control team, we're gonna kill it. We're gonna kill the control team, I mean. So we chose- we got the red dam- oh, we this is perfect. Okay. Oh, okay, so this is not perfect. Um... I don't- I don't want mountainous mining bodies out. That would be quite devastating. It's immune to black damage, so Dobie is not very useful over there. Um... Mamiji can start suppressing it, though. Jesse absolutely has to come over. Yumiko. Darklink, absolutely. Slows with Nicole. Dark Buddhist. Frost for the slows. Stimal Sal for the damage. Telemachus for the damage. Llama can stay where he is. Apple should come over. Cheese is working. And Light of Seven. Oh, we're gonna, he's going to stay where he is. Uh, we also need to remember about the train tickets, so somebody needs to keep an eye on that. How about Petrie keeps an eye on the ticket for now? Dobi can move up here. Just in case that little red escapes. Alright, we're gonna slow the black guy. We don't really care about... Uh, Alright, so where did the white fixer... The white fixer is moving toward the central command team. So let's execute the remaining employees in the central command. There's only two of them. Slow down the black fixer. He might use his black attack, which would be not good. If he releases all of the abnormalities here, that means the mountain is going to get out. Which is probably not that big of a deal. Doing the release, there's a black shield. He's using, he's using ha his hammer to attack so far. I'm going to keep the lights, probably. It's a bit risky to keep the lights. And the lights go out, and the lights go out, and the lights go out, and the lights go out. Now it's... No, 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 wait, no, no, no. Ah, oh, crap. Dark, where is dark? I 
I think he's suppressing. Oh god, it's really he's releasing things. We didn't we were not fast enough, unfortunately. But luckily, we've got like everyone in, like the entire crew is here. Where is the bullet going? It's not gonna hit anyone. Dark. No, you need to well you can actually start beating beating up on the white fixer, I guess. Slow it down. Alright, as soon as we get rid of this, suppress this thing. I'm going to slow it down. Um, yeah, okay, yeah, Little Red escaped, which is the thing I was kind of worried about. Um, Apple, no, you need to leave. I'm going to give a red shield to P3. We got the Knight of Despair counting down and their fry shoots. So this is only the first trumpet, nothing to worry about. Where's the white? Apple is dead? What? Oh, god damn it. He got shot in the back. Crap. This thing deals too much. Oh, wait. Yeah, it deals increased damage because red is on the clock. Of course. We are lucky to not have lost more employees here then. Alright, Dark Link. You need to come over and deal with little red. You need to do that. Doby he already has a red shield up. White Fixer is being dealt with by Dark Buddhist. We just need to make sure that nobody on the way hits it. Or starts hitting it, rather. Yeah, that was that was my mistake. Uh, I, I really... F no, no, no. No, no, guys. Guys, you don't understand. You have to move down. No! God damn it. You, you idiots. You were idiots. Move over. Darkling. No, Darkling needs to move in. Darkling is doing good. Dolby needs to start running. Do Dolby. Dolby, you need to go move. Uh, you guys. You guys have to leave for now. Yeah, Little Red is really, really dangerous. Alright, go work the Nameless Fetus. That's going to change her focus. Good. Uh, the white fixer is doing things. We don't really care about that just yet. All right, everyone can stay here. No, 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 no. We need, we need to, we need to make sure that this thing is dealt with, though. Uh, Telmachus can work the night of despair. So unfortunately, that means that this department is completely dead now. We can't really work it. Um. Luckily, nothing here can escape except for Void Dream. We can probably still manage. We can probably still manage Void Dream. Let's see, like, um, yeah, yeah, definitely can still manage Void Dream. Okay, make sure that this guy's done with. Very good result. Name Sweet is lovely. Toby can leave. Uh, you P3 should pick up this thing. The white damage isn't up on the clock, so we can speed up. Dark, you need to work on the white fixer now. Sure, it's gonna swipe and deal some white damage, but again, it's not on the clock, so we don't care. Oh, the red damage is on the clock, though. Uh, yeah, I kind of forgot. Luckily, we are healing off. I don't give him red shields. I got no more bullets. Okay, that's... No! Leave! Baddies. Okay, so we need to actually pay attention, because uh, with increased red damage, the amount of damage that the... That it, this thing reflects is actually quite significant. Maybe Darkling is the only one who can who can face tank it at this point. Let's see if Darkling can't face tank it. I'm gonna let Dark Buddhist go go back to his place. All right, everyone, go back to your home departments, I guess. Kind of, not really. <clears throat> Luckily, the white fixer is almost dead. 
Darkling took a lot of damage there. This was healing a lot of damage. Yeah, okay, yeah, that was that was fine. Oh, okay, that, that could have been worse. Uh, losing Apple is unfortunate, but at this point I'm willing to accept and move on. Willing to accept and move on because unfortunately that's just that's just that's just the price of uh, the cost of admission here basically. Uh, yeah. So how do we work now? Well, we need to avoid red damage. So the only thing we really need to remember is to not we don't have very many red damage abnormalities anyways. So like we can work these things once. We can work pretty much all of our abnormalities once. We can work censored even. Yeah, I think this is this is acceptable. Except for nothing there. We can't work nothing there. What is like other safe abnormalities we can work? We can work Yin relatively safely. Uh we can work well we can we can pick up the ticket relatively safely. Alright. I still don't know when Gibura is going to show up. I'm imagining she's going to show up on level 5 of uh, Cliff Off Meltdowns, and that will be fun. That will be fun. What else could be fun is if 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 I lose... I thought about this already, right? Like, I'm, if I lose all of my employees, and all that's left to do is to suppress Gibura, I'm just going to let my employees die. That's it. They are all going to die down here. Alright, let's make sure that cheese, uh, that, that this thing is reset so that I don't, see, don't accidentally kill cheese. Like I already have once, I think. Alright, so we did good on Censored. Let us sink with Carmen. No! I will not sink! I will rise up to victory and glory! Alright, Jesse can work in one more time. We're getting there. Uh, the thing is, only that we'll have to deal with level 10. <laughs> like, the only problem is that we actually have to go to level 10 to win or suppress Gibura. I'm not going to go there anymore. The chances, the, the risks are too high. Uh, Telemachos can probably work the little prince. I don't think he worked it very often. Okay, we get good. This La Luna is also very good boxes. We get, we just got a perfect score on it for twenty. That's pretty great. Pretty neato. That's pretty neat. I can work Yin probably on this. We can work Yin on this side now because that one does not have any Cliff Off Overload. Cliff Off Overload isn't shared on these, so. All right, so we got six meltdowns coming in. Soon, we can deal with this one. Yeah, black damage is not on the list. Only red damage is on the list. Right now, at least. We'll see what happens on the next level. I expect to see like, black and white, or at least some com like at least some combination of those. I'm gonna wait until uh, Magical Girl is done working with. Uh, wait, did I execute employees on this on this level? I did not execute enough employees, didn't I? Apple died, I executed two of these guys, so I think I should kill one more. Oh, I don't have bullets. Oh man, that's a shame. I can use their Freischutz's bullet, I guess. Yeah, sure, let's use their Freischutz. I was gonna kill two. But that's... whatever, dude. Maybe it, maybe it actually only killed one. For some reason, that employee just did not die. Oh! Oh! Wait, I just remembered. We have, uh... We have, uh... Hezed. I think Hezed is the guy who gives 25% chance of not dying for employees. Like, I wish that worked on Apple, but it didn't. Um, uh, so yeah, unfortunately Apple has died. Or maybe it has worked on Apple and he just took, um, lethal damage multiple times. That can happen. Alright, so let's see what type of damage do we get next. Roll the dice! Oh. Oh, okay, so now it switches from Hezet to Gebura. I get it. 
I get it. Alright, so what's actually melting down? Let's deal with meltdowns first. Um, Steam on Sal and Frost are gonna deal with that. Let's see here. I, I might actually pay for my insolence and not... For, for, for my insolence of not looking at what uh, Gibura actually does. Alright, I think mag I think Punishing Word is going to escape. I don't really care. Alright, so let's first deal with uh, the abnormalities that are melting down. And then we're going to switch over to Gibura. We can also call for a rabbit team suppression on this at this stage. I think this might be a good idea. We are still we are going to level ten regardless. Yeah, let's call for a rabbit team suppression on uh, Gibura. No, let's call let's call for a rabbit team suppression on Gibura after we are done with uh, uh, suppressing all these things. We got a couple of items to suppress. One of these items will be this thing. We need to immediately leave, and this thing, which we need to immediately return. So, it, as far as I remember, she's just going to walk around. For now, at least. Again, if we lose all of our employees, so be it. This is probably the last day anyway. As far as I know, to progress to the next day, you need to have suppressed Bina and Hokma, and I have not done that, so... We'll see, we'll see, won't we? It would be rather epic if all employees are going to die and that's gonna be the end. <laughs> Alright, what is she resistant to actually? Oh, she's endured to everything. I think she deals massive amounts of red and white damage with her attacks. Oh, we got a bad result and happy teddy bear. Who cares? Like, honestly. Who cares? Nobody. Okay, so. Let's pause and think about this. Do we only want Aleph level employees suppressing her? If yes, then we should probably gather those Aleph level employees. Somewhere like the welfare team, for example. Do I want Momiji there? Probably. I want both, actually. Let's move these guys over too. Let's move Ka let's move Telemachus over, definitely. Move Darkling over, definitely. As soon as we're ready, we're also going to move... We're also going to call upon the aid of Little Red. Don't forget about that. Whatever little aid this is. I'll... Keep Dark... Down here. For now. Because, uh... We, we can always call him in back, right? We can always call, call upon his aid. Uh, what about these guys? Well... You guys are a little weaker. But you do bring amounts of pale damage, so maybe I, I should save you guys these guys for later. You, we also got a ranged black weapon, but I'm a little a little bit wary about it because I think Gibura can just insta give them, and uh, I have only limited number of bullets. All right, so let's authorize a call for the rabbit team. I think she's good. She's just going to com in, like just completely waste wipe the floor with the rabbits. But uh, it's still better to call them in. Right now, I think. Because at least they're going to deal some damage, right? Alright, let's let's probably move. Um, m m let's move into a corridor. No, let's move into an elevator for safety. The elevators are the safest places, so let's move into an elevator. If I remember correctly, she she has like a dash attack of some kind. Rabbits are at least dealing a decent number of damage to it. Okay, so she's charging now. Okay, so she is gonna charge and is gonna end up in the this team. Okay. Half a rabbit is wiped out. Yeah, so Rabbit is going to leave now, but it did do a significant amount of damage to Red Mist. Yeah, she's gonna wipe out all the employees on the way. Uh, Rabbit leaves. Rabbit leaves now. And we are moving in. is going to stay there. She's not really going to do anything. 
I think I'm going to send uh, these employees, the weaker ones, over there. I'm going to let Dark pick up the ticket. And then send him over here. Like, again, Gibura is not going to move it. the Red Mist, I mean. What is that? Well, I'm assuming that is act just, just the Red Mist, that thing around her. But I don't know what it does. Tell me, what great purpose did we have in those actions? I don't know, dude. You tell me. I'm not going to spend bullets on executing people. That's just uh, wasting bullets at this stage. I think I'm going to try to save the lights, probably. Alright, everyone move over to Gibura. We need to be like super duper careful because like as soon as she as soon as she shows that she's about to do the charge attack, we we must leave. I'm also going to wait until she's closer to this side of the room. Just to be on the safer side of things. Two lights. Alright, I think this is the time we go. Oh god, this is not that great. I'm gonna give these guys black and red and white shields. Alright, she is gone. Let's leave. She's gonna do the charge now. Okay. And she's gonna end up in which room? Uh, she is going to end up... Oh, she's going to end up in the same room again. Okay. No, wait. This one. Alright. Yeah, let's move over here and prepare. I don't like her being in the Central Command, though. Like, Central Command is a bit of a... Not a good room for us to fight her in. I don't think so. I also don't remember, like, what what is... What is her gimmick in this in this stage? She has um Oh, that's right. She's got uh, she's got the capo and the thing. Doesn't she? Yeah, she no, yeah, she's got the capo and mimicry. So she's resistant to black and white da and so red and white damage, but weak to weak against black. Um, hmm. Do we want to fight her? Is the question. Let's let's wait until we have. Let's wait until we have four lights, and then we'll go down there. All right. I think it's time, though. All right. I don't know what. Okay. So this is. This looks like a big old red damage attack. Yeah. That was. That was. That was. That was, that was quite red. I'll admit that. That was there was a lot of red damage there. Yep, she deals a lot. Alright, let's see how much actual damage that was. Um Yeah, it was it was pretty considerable, all all, all things considered. Uh <laughs> All right, that that is pro that looks like a white type of damage. I'm quite happy that I did. I think that's going to be another white. But luckily, all right, we got this. All right, we got we got her third stage. Let's leave. Whoa. Okay, uh, that was that was a little scary. Let's pick up the four lights. That is going to fully heal us. Unfortunately, I think at this point we kind of need to uh, move up to the next Cliffhot Meltdown level. Because we're running low on bullets. I don't want to die because of lack of bullets. What is that? So that's, that's the black damage thing from Mountain and that? I don't know what that is. That looks dope AF though, like... Alright, so she takes... She's not resistant to pale and black, but takes normal black and or red and white damage. Um... Um... Well, let's try this. Okay, so let's move in there. It's going to be a lot of black damage. We're gonna give everyone black and pale shields, and then we'll move into the room. 
And I think we'll just rinse and repeat after that. Because, I, I, like, this is the most reliable way, way to give all of our employees a black and a pale shield. And then we move in there. And we kick her butt. And that was black damage. She broke our shields instantly. She broke our shields instantly. Let's give him another black shield. Let's go in there again. Okay! That insta killed Telemacho, Stimalsal, and Yumiko. Uh, that was a lot of pale damage, by the way. Little Red, uh, would you would you kindly assist us, please, with this matter? Um, yeah. So, uh, yeah. Let's not. Let's try to not get hit by that then. <laughs> Um, three more employees hit hit the hit the hit the what's it called? Hit it. They're hit. They hit the rock. They hit the rock bottom and die. Fucking die. All right. Well, let's see how long Little Red is gonna last. She does take increased red damage. Or not increased, but like. You know what I mean. She takes she takes normal amounts of red damage there. Yeah, okay, that, that thing does a lot of fucking pale damage. Holy crap. Okay, well little, little red does have health. damage, yes. Judgment. The... Whoa! Oops. Let's let's stand here instead. <laughs> uh, let's use... No, 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 no. Uh, one of these guys. Please use the ticket. Yeah, good thing I didn't send anyone, like, who is actually not very resistant. Um, so again... I'm not sure how much of the of a help this is going to be, but I hope it is at least somewhat helpful. Rather ranged damages. Slow her down. She seems to be a little stuck. Um. Yumiko, oh Yumiko's dead. Uh, do we have anyone else ranged in here? I don't know. Who else is ranged in this team? Llama, but he deals black damage. This is where those pistols would have come in handy. <laughs> Stimal Sal is dead, and Apple is dead also, and they used to, and they, they were the people with uh, Sound of a Star, of which we only lost only one, luckily. Telemachus 3.0 is dead, which means we lost another one of these sites, but luckily not the weapon. Telemachus, Stimal Sal, Yumiko, well Yumiko's equipment is easy, easily replenished. Well, if she's not going to move, then... This is going to be where we kill her. Unless she has some other special move. I think this is a lot of black damage. Let's not take that black damage. Yeah, okay. Yeah, this, this wave is ranged as well. Wow. That is just ridiculous. I need to be careful, though. Like, what kind of attacks does she still have that are... Is she gonna just be stuck this whole time here? Let's watch her, but also let's watch uh, the timer. Two lights. Three lights. As soon as it's four lights, I'm going to pick up. Oh! She left. Alright. 
Yeah, she does. She does have a move ability. You can pick up the light safely, though. So. Right, where is she going to end up? In the control team. Well, rip control team. The mountain is agitated, but at this point, I don't really care. Okay. What is it going to do now? Just walk around? Do I hire Little Red again? I don't really have that much energy left. Oh god. Um, okay, well, let's see if it actually just doesn't react to ranged attacks at all. I mean, it probably does. This, this department is too tiny! Yeah, so far, she's just standing there. Let's see. Do we just not react to range of attacks? Is that what's happening? Alright, I'm going to spend my last bullet to ex execute this thing. Um, this will be a lot of black damage. Yeah, let's try to move out of the way of that. Luckily, she's out of range. No, 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 guys. You stand in the elevators. Elevators are safe. Elevators are love. Elevators are life. As soon as I see her trying to do some kind of a dash or something, we run. That's a spear. Four lights is also a trigger. I think we're about to hit four lights. I'm sorry if I if my commentary is just a little, uh, what do you call it, monotonous. But this is really intense. All right, four lights. Please use the four lights. I think this she's going to charge soon. Like, there's no way she's not going to charge. Luckily, if I remember correctly, uh, her fourth stage is not that important. If we really have to, we can always pull out Mamiji and uh, let her regenerate out of the room with red mist. Like with this, if if a spear is thrown, uh, unluckily a few times in a row or something. Like there's no way she's not going to leave soon. I'm waiting for it. Obviously, I'd like it if she just got stuck like that, like that, like that, for the entire time. But I don't think that's gonna happen. That's a spear. I don't have bullets to heal you up. Luckily, this like I'm so happy that that sword attack is out of range. The two lights on the train. That's another spear coming in. Okay, things are getting a little dicey. Uh, I think we step out with Mamiji and regenerate. We can regenerate, we can also pick up the fourth light over here. Oh no, she's moving. Oh, that sucks. I guess I'll just have to wait until she moves back to the end, far end of the room. Yeah, that's kind of that kind of sucks that she moved, but hey, could be worse. Could be a lot worse. We could have all, we could have all been getting hit by these freaking pale damage attacks. She did not leave. I think that I think I understand like what what's the glitch here. I think the glitch is when she is trying to, like when she reaches the door, she gets kind of stuck in this uh, leaving loop. I'm sad that Yumiko is dead, but at least she can join me in heaven now. Oh well. We'll see, maybe none of the employees will survive this day. Yeah, like right now she probably would be stuck in the doorway here. But unfortunately I don't really have the time to walk all the way around. 
I'd rather her, her get stuck in a different doorway, like in the opposite one. Please walk towards the opposite doorway. Please walk more towards the opposite doorway. Like, wh what happens if I enter the room now? Is she gonna just stand there? Yeah, she's just standing. No, 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 we... Oh god. Okay, we... Mamiji's dead. Okay, that, that move literally killed Mamiji. Thank... Good, good job, me. Um... So now we, we don't have any range. And there's no way for us to, like, really move out of the way of that pale attack, I think it's, like, it, it, it's area of effect just kills us. We don't have shields. We have, we have one more ranged person. Llama. Llama, my, my boy. You gotta, you gotta save the day for us here. No, stop walking with him. There we go. And now she's standing in the correct, uh, in the correct position. Come on, dude, really? She's got not that much health left. I'm upset. We can also keep running around trying to juke all of the abnormalities that will escape if I click the button. So maybe it will be the correct course of action to do that. Alternatively, I could also just keep releasing a little red. Sounds like a good idea. At least to me. Let's not stand in the way, though. So we can call upon Little Red, uh... Three more times? Damn it, my Miji's also dead. Damn it! Did we lose her equipment? Only the weapon. Gotta be really, really careful about losing equipment like that. Okay, yeah, the red mist is taking damage. That's really, really good damage. Good job. Alright, she might go down. Alright, she did go down. Red mist is in her final form. Um, no, 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 no. Where are you going? No, 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 where are you going? Eve, run and run! Oh my god! Oh! Jesse's died. Jesse died. Uh, ha, ha, ha. Yeah, um. This does not look good here. Jesse, Frost, the Darkling, Nicole, Petrie. Uh. Jesse. Frost, uh, Nicole, Darkling, P3, Oh, the Knight of Despair is about to escape. That's lovely. Darkling, Nicole, P3. Petri? Is Petri dead? Petri? Oh yeah, he was in there with the rest, of course. Uh, <laughs> um, yeah, we leave now. Ow, Dobby is dead, and Dark Buddhist is also dead. Ouch! Dobby is also dead. Mountain of Smiting Bodies is out. I don't think I care at this point. You know what? Yeah, I really I really think I don't care at this point. I cannot stop. Oh, oh she killed everyone in that bunch. Alright. I will kill all. Yeah, I, I can't believe you. I can't believe you. I think you can kill all. I think I'm going to help you with that too.
Holy crap, she does damage. I think she's weak to everything though now. Um, where is everybody? Oh, Llama is also still alive. Yeah, I kind of forgot about that. Mm, so where is she going to end up? In the welfare team. Oh. That's lovely. That's lovely! Alright, boys. You gotta go into the welfare team. You gotta make your way downtown. Walking fast. Walk. Just walk as fast as you can. At this point, I am, I've accepted that we're going to lose our entire crew. Oh. Hello there! Llama and cheesecake. Uh, the last employee is Light of Seven. Go in there, buddy. I believe in you. You got this. I don't believe in you, by the way. Chaser! Chaser, Light of Seven! I believe! You just gotta believe! Is he gonna get killed by the train? That'd be funny. Nope, no, he's not gonna get killed by the train. Hell, although that was close. Right, no, no, no. Oh, he's gonna get killed by the... No, he's not gonna get killed by the Night of Despair, either. Okay, then. Whee! What? Oh. I don't get to cheese the game? No. no! No! I thought you might have a different outcome since you found the answer. But even you failed. It must mean that a failure is an inevitable cycle for us. But look, even though we're failures, we managed to achieve one thing. We can see Carmen again like this. Although we can't have a nap on their field land of the warm sun like we did in the past. She's alive. Watching us. She will understand. She will tell you that you couldn't make it to the end, but you did a good job reaching here, that you will have eternal rest with her. We should have listened to Benjamin in the We should have listened in to Benjamin in the first place. My biggest regret and sin is that I did not stop when I should. Carmen is our son. It doesn't matter if we're underground forever. Attention all employees, we congratulate your honorable retirement. This broadcast is pre-recorded. Let us sink, Carmen. You can't hear my voice, but I don't care. I will not open a door anymore. I wish I'm with you when I open my eyes again someday. We thank you for your hard work and show respect to your efforts and loyalty. Good night. <sighs> well, we could con we could try to continue day forty eight and do it again. I'll have to consider how what to do now. Uh, now that I've realized that you can't just suicide every single employee of yours to achieve victory on this stage. Um. In fact, I'm not quite sure what to do to achieve victory at this stage. Um, maybe we can have all employees except for... Like, we can work to up to level 5. And then we can kill off all of our employees except for Telemachos. Who cannot take white damage. And then press the button to release all abnormalities. He cannot take... He cannot die to the blue star. We just, we just have to be really, really careful and dodge, like, literally everything with, with Telemachos for the rest of the day. Uh, we'll see. That might be fun. Uh, thank you so much for... Thank you very much, guys, for watching. We got super duper close. We almost did it. But almost was not enough. I'll see you again next time. Bye-bye.